What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Dark Souls. I'm Mr. Chad, and welcome to the Ulusil Township. Um, as I said before, I was going to get invaded, and the instant that I crossed that barrier line right over here, I did get invaded. So, <laughs> I didn't have a chance to record it, but, because, uh, like, literally, I just wanted to get get to this bonfire and then um, turn back on the camera but I, I didn't have my software set up. I was going to quit out and then come back again. Then we we're going to attempt some PvP. But I screwed up. And whatever. We died. It's not a big deal. Um, yeah. Uh, basically, I got I got shoved off here with uh, Wrath of God or whatever the heck it is. That's okay. Alright. So, we are going to continue into the blackness of this place. Um... This place is quite interesting because uh, these are actually all humans. Um, all these guys here are humans that have been corrupted by the Abyss. <clears throat> so, before this DLC, you, you would have thought that Darkstalker Koth was actually telling the truth um, by saying, you know, oh, well, you're, you're just a pawn of Frampt and all these other things. But actually, the real story is, is that Darkness turns humans into this. So, you know, is this better Is this better than having the gods back in power? Um, that's debatable, I guess. Because the gods were still corrupt. And they did, like, try to exile undeads and people and everything and whatever. But, you know, is this really a better fate than linking a bonfire? Or linking the fire at the end? Um, I actually did go over here. So I, I had an invasion failure. And uh, I, I was running around, running around, running around, looking for something to do while the invader popped up. And uh, I went to go down there, and I got um, an item by the name of the Silver Pendant, which is right uh, here. So the Silver Pendant, what it does is uh, it actually deflects dark spells. So we'll need that for the last boss, essentially. And you'll see why eventually. Okay, and uh, we can we can uh, get this DLC wrapped not too too many parts. I think it's like one or two maybe, and uh, that that should be more than enough. I think. Let's make sure I block these guys. They actually do do quite a bit of damage. So yeah, out. And also these guys shooting dark beads from across the way, kind of annoying. Um, dark beads actually do uh, stamina damage as well. Ouch. These guys have always been really annoying. Okay, and wah. And wah. Okay. Excelente. And kill the sorcerers whenever you see them. Oh, this guy has humanity. Great. Sucked in his soul. Uh, all these guys, as you notice, they're actually all backstabbable. So if you're having trouble with them uh, in a straight up fight, then you can just backstab them all. All right, you can see that uh, the abyss has spread quite far in here. Um, the further we go down, the more abyssal goop you're going to see. And uh, if you listen carefully, um, well, obviously you can't listen carefully with me talking, but if you listen, um, there's actually people screaming. You can hear screams in the distance. and I mean, this this place has been long gone. This place is very, very long gone, so... Those screams must be like hauntings or something, because it, it's just, yeah, I don't know. Like, I, I don't know if this is actually haunted or not. It, it, I, you know what I'm saying. Haunted screams or actual somebody screaming. Oh, that did not work at all how I planned. Wow. Oh, oh, and I'm dead. Sweet. So, first rule fight club. Engage the pursuers, uh, or the, uh, not the pursuers, gosh. He hit me with the pursuers, which is that spell that sort of one-shots you. Um, engage the mages up close if you can, because they will wreck your shit really fast. All right, so let's rush through again, and uh, I'll be back in just a second here. Okay, and we're back again. Sorry, guys, I'm getting a little bit tired, uh... I've recorded a few parts, and, uh, yeah, I'm just getting a little bit, <laughs> just a little bit tired. And, uh, this may be our last part before I actually go to sleep. Oh, yes. Alright, so let's try and do this. 
one more freaking time. Oh, and don't forget the guy who drops from up here. Because uh, he'll follow you to death and beyond. I can hear those little bastards laughing down there. Yeah, you want to laugh? Laugh it up! Oh, can I get... Can I actually get over there? Let's see. Ah! Suckers! Ow! Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. Just die. Just, just, you know, just seriously die. Die with a vengeance. And uh, it's a good thing that they keep, they've got given me a lot of these blood red mosses. Because I actually can use them. Alright, sweet. So let's, uh, let's draw a few more of these guys out into the open. There's actually a sorcerer up there, so you want to make sure you do not aggro him. Uh, or if you do... Uh, try to hide a little bit so he falls. He should fall, I think. Let's see what he does. Oh, I guess he's not going to try and fall. That's okay. Um, is there anything back here? No. Okay. Oh, there he goes. He fell. Uh, I heard another one. Oh my god, these guys are terrifying. Holy crap, that thing just hit me from nowhere. Yeah, the the uh, <clears throat> the dark beat spell is actually really insanely powerful. Um, most of all, out oh, I dodged. Come on, man. Most of all, because of its uh, as just outrageous, <clears throat> outrageous tracking. And by tracking, obviously, I mean like how it homes in on you. It's insane how fast it can home in on you. Whoa! <laughs> you will not get me. I will become more powerful than you will ever know. Alright. <clears throat> Voice is getting a little bit <clears throat> shoddy, if you will. Uh, where's the, where are these guys laughing from? Stop laughing at me. Ah, there you are. Bastards, take this. Looks like lightning and fire sort of do pretty well against them, just mediocre against them. Uh... So around here, we want to do some sunlight, and it'll open up secret doors so we can see them. Yay. Um, unlike the other secret doors in the game where you can kind of just hit them, uh, these ones actually require the spell Light. Um, it's an Ulusil spell, so you have to be either here or you have to go and uh, get it from Dusk. I guess before she hollows, like she did in our game, so yeah. Why are they all laughing at me? Stop it. It's not very nice. Okay, um, can I roll in? I think I can roll into here, I'm pretty sure, yeah. Hey, you gonna laugh? Die! Die, 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 die! Yeah, there you go. Laugh at that. Fool. Uh, oh, that's why he was laughing, because this is a mimic. <laughs> Bastards. <clears throat> I see your game, you rogue. Alright, sweet. What do we get? Krusky. And what does it do? Because I can't remember. Uh, bent crust key. Uh, grooves. Okay. So it does something. I, of that, of which I'm sure. It does something. So, yeah. My, my, uh, my expert analysis, um, is confirmed. A plus. Oh. A little bit of lag there. Lag spike. Okay. Have any more laughers in here? Anyone want to make fun of me? That's what I thought. Alright, cool. So let's go here. I believe that there's uh, some stuff to be had. Ah, yes, there's one. Some tween homandatas. My favorite. Alright, let's go. Uh, we'll jump down the rooftops, I believe. Yep. Cool beans. And plunge attack, because I can. Oh, there's another thing over there that I can go grab. Is it right here? Yes, it is. Soul of a hero. Cool. Yeah, I, I don't know. Th this place seems very hard for a mid-level, now that I'm sort of thinking about it. It seems pretty damn intense. Um, yeah, maybe this isn't made for that type of thing. Oh, shortcut. Yay. Okay, so here is the shortcut to that bonfire that we had earlier. So if ever we die, we can just come right back to here. It's fantastic. 
Um, I'm not going to go back to there because I don't actually need it. Um, not yet, anyway. If I die one more time, then uh, I'll kindle, get invaded, etc, etc, etc. Yes. Okay, so there's a few uh, dark bead mages here and a few of the evil motherfuckers. We just want to make sure that we do not get touched by them. Ouch. Like that. Ouch. Like that. Oh my gosh. Oh gosh. No, 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 no. Okay. And utterly, completely trapped in a wall. Great. Uh, but so we're going to have to kill these guys again because if we don't, then our, we're going to die before we reach the elevator. Ah, damn, I hate that little slap move. You guys suck. You suck. Oh, come on, man. Freaking dodging. You can't dodge that. You don't have the agility for that. There we go. <laughs> it's like Ninja kicked his ass all the way up to that roof. Oh, my God. That deserves a slow-mo. <laughs> Okay, let's try this one more time. So this is a very useful elevator, as you can tell. And uh, we're going to try and just rush it once more. And wah. let's cut him up. I say cut him up. I say cut him up. Why are you not cutting? Cut. There you go. Yeah, those dark bead guys are just so freaking annoying. So, yeah. Ah, do you see that? Do you see? Do you see how annoying that is? Oh shit, he's toxifying me. Ah, crap. And ouch. And ouch, and ouch, and ouch, and ouch. Okay, another humanity. Wow, this is not turning out well at all. And they're laughing at me. Fucking bastards. God damn, I hate these fucking bastards. Die already. Die. Die. Just fucking die. Good lord. It's like the scythe just needs a little bit more... <clears throat> it needs a little bit more speed. I know it's really fast, but... It just needs a tad bit more speed, and it's perfect for these guys. Ugh. That is so frustrating. Oh my goodness. Okay, finally... Uh, I believe this is uh, a mini-boss right here, or a sub-boss, I suppose. Very strange sub-boss. He has like a, like, just a weird amalgamation of shit. It makes no sense. Oh, fuck. I'm actually bouncing off of him. I never noticed that. Oh, crap. Okay, so how do I get this guy? Okay. Um, let's drink up. I actually don't know how to beat this guy. Um, what do we do here? Can we slice? Guess we have to ow. Guess we just have to slice him up like this. Oh my god. Oh jeez. Okay. A lot of these guys are just resistant to like all damage. Oh fucking A. Jesus, man. Why am I getting screwed up so hard all of a sudden? I just can't, like, dodge. Oh, God! Come on! I dodged that! Oh, my... Oh, my God! Oh, my... Oh, my God! Come on! Please! For the love of crap! Just die! Just fucking die! My God! Ugh! You sons of bitches! My God! I don't know what it is. I'm just doing so poorly right now. It's insane. Okay, finally. Let's get into the fucking abyss. Jeez. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. It scared the fuck out of me. I forgot about that. Oh, you fucking assholes. You fucking assholes. Oh, fuck it. I'm not even going to go back up there and pillage. Oh, you bitches. You fucking bitches. All right. So now we are in a an abyssal gel cell. Alright. Now then. 
fun times ahead because I'm going to kindle in order to get some stuff because this is the last bonfire before the boss, I believe. And this is literally the abyss. I mean, this is it right here. Oops. I don't really have any souls anywhere, so don't matter. Let's restore and kindle. Yeah, this place, this place has some truly great atmosphere. Oh man, just look at that. Just look at that black hole. Ah, oh, you just know that there's something there. Something in the darkness. And there is something in the darkness. Namely, the father of the abyss. His name is Manus. Alright. Let's, uh, just look at this. Look at this. Look how scary this shit is. Okay. We're gonna get a little bit of lag here and there because there's actually a lot of dudes on screen right now that you can't see. Oh, come here. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. There's actually a lot of dark bead sorcerers down here too. You see all of them glowing right there. Motherfuckers. Suckers. Yeah, look at that. Look at that <laughs> fucking pro dodging. Okay, and now all of a sudden I'm like some sort of MLG pro at dodging. Yeah, whatever. It happens. Now, I believe if I follow a certain path, I'll be able to actually... S oh, dark bead, yay! Now I got a dark bead of my own, fools. Alright, good. If I follow a certain path, and I believe it's this one right here, uh, you actually get led into another area um, where Sif actually is. Since uh, Sif is actually Artorius' dog, his, like, companion, um, they actually came here into the abyss together, but uh, obviously... Oh, yeah. But obviously, uh, Artorius did not make it, so... Um, Sif actually saved... Uh, or, sorry. Artorius actually saved Sif with his great shield and cast a, a spell on him. And, uh... Oh, okay. Let's see here. Oh, yep. There it is. Here's Alvina. So, Alvina leads you to Sif, who's here. And uh, now you you uh, face Dark Souls, essentially. I mean, I, they're just spirits here, like humanities, but the Abyss kind of consumes everything and everyone, so, you know, what these actually are, it, it's, it looks exactly like humanities. I mean, they're identical to humanities, so I assume it's just the soul of, of humanity. Okay, and here we found another shortcut. Excellent. Uh, actually, I don't know if that was a real shortcut or not. I guess we'll find out soon, won't we? And uh, don't let these guys touch you. Because, uh, as you know, it's just right there. Uh, the longer that they're touching you, the worse. Oh, come on, dude. Come here. Whatever you are. Okay. Uh... Oh, I guess I was supposed to go up there. Yeah. My brain am smart. My brain am smart. We, we might actually be able to kill Manus in this episode. This would be quite interesting if we could just beat it all in one go. Or uh, I guess it'd be two parts, but um, yeah. And then we are on to the last boss after this. Down. Where the freaking crap are we? I actually don't remember this. Um, Oh, oh, I see. Okay, I get it. Alright, cool. Alright, so we have a way out, I guess. Um, still no invasion. Which is good for us, because we don't really have great tools at our disposal. Why is there... I feel like Sif was supposed to be here. Am I just blind as hell? Or do I have to go down? Oh, I probably have to go down. Oh my god. I'm so stupid, guys. I'm sorry. 
It's late. I'm I'm just getting tired. I really apologize for this poor play. <laughs> Oh yeah, if you don't take out this guy, then he'll just snipe you from the top here. It's so frustrating. Okay, but I'm just gonna keep following these stones because I I honestly can't remember everything about this place. God, just, oh, it's so black. It's so black. Oh man. Hey, come here. Come here, fool. Aha! You cannot stop my moi 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 moi. I think these guys actually drop humanities. I mean, obviously, since they are humanities, but I'm trying to. I'm having a hard time remembering like what they actually drop, if anything at all. But they're they're really cool little creatures. Um, they're completely silent, and they just sort of float at you. I mean, it's spooky. I guess they make like a little noise, but it's not that much. You see like souls of children down here. And I, I wonder, you know, lore wise. Okay, they do drop humanities. I wonder lore wise if uh, they actually like consume. Like the reason why they're, they're hurting me is because they're like, oh, there's a body. You know, or, or there's a soul. Like I want that soul as well or something. Because when you have humanities, you basically get corrupted by them. Um, absolutely. So, yeah. Yeah, humanity works very strangely in this game. It's cool, though. Very unique. Um, did I just run in a circle? Oh, no, I did. I right, good. Okay, so this is uh, interesting. Okay. The little children's souls are no big deal for my scythe. That's great. Maybe it's better to just stand still and do this. Yeah, there we go. So I'm not charging into them. This might be a little better. And I saw I know I, I, I saw those uh, those other things, but I'm gonna I'm gonna cut these guys up first. Kinda reminds me of the babies. The skeleton babies. Back you fiends! Back you fiends! Back! You cannot have my humanity! Get out of here! Get out of here. Get out of here. Oh, man. So, yeah, do you, do you still think that Darkstar... Do you still think that Darkstalker Koth is on your side? I mean, this is what he wrought. It is horrifying, you know? Like, destroyed an entire town, turned them into fucking monsters. In addition to that... He brought this insane... Oh, am I supposed to go over here? I honestly don't remember. Ah, oh, shit. Please don't die. Please don't die. Please don't die. Okay, good. Oh, my God. Down and down and down we go. Okay. I am here. I see... Oh, there's the boss fog. And I feel like I'm missing something for some reason. Well, I know that I'm missing Sif, but, like, where the crap is he? Oh, God. Got here. Damn. Demons. Hell. Okay, so there's the boss fog. So where is Sif? Did I just completely miss him? Or maybe it's because I killed him already? I don't... But this is the past, so he's not dead, is he? He's not dead. He shouldn't be dead. I mean, that wouldn't make any sense. Um, oh yeah, there's also another thing I missed here. What is it? Twin Humanities. A lot of freaking Humanities down here. That's all I can really say. Oh man. Where the hell is Sif? Because you can actually summon Sif in battle, which is kind of cool. Um, we already went that way. Let's go up. <coughs> Be wary of Caster. Okay, where is he? I should probably heal if there's a freaking stupid bastard up here. Okay. Uh, is this exactly where I left off? Oh my god, I'm so stupid. 
Oh my god. Oh jeez, mother effing crap. Uh, okay. Okay, I honestly don't know where Sif is, and if he's in here, I have no clue where he is. Um, I followed Alvina to where he was supposed to be. I thought that's where he was supposed to be, but I guess not. So where the freaking crap is he? And uh, let's let's go down here. Get this item here, I suppose. Okay. The help me carving. Okay. All right. Okay, I, I guess he's just not here anymore. Um, I must have waited too long or something. That's my guess. All right, let's just go finish this bitch and be done with it. Hidden path ahead. <laughs> Liars. Oh boy, I cannot see. Um, okay, where the hell am I going here? Oh, up here. Ah, yes. Okay. So let's go down to the bridge, down to Manus. We actually don't need Sif, but uh, he does help a lot, I'll tell you that. He does help a lot. Um, before I do this, I'm going to, yeah, do this. Uh, keep my silver pendant with me, because Manus will cast uh, a ton of shadow magic. And this will actually deflect it. As I mentioned before, and I think in the previous video I actually mentioned that. Um, or maybe it's the same one, I don't know. Parts are getting convoluted for me. Okay. Let's cut them up. And the final souls. Cut them up. Alright, and since we have so many freaking humanities, let's just use one. Why not? Yeah, crush it. And surprisingly, no one invaded me that entire time. Um, I guess this isn't a very popular place to invade. Another lag spike there. Okay. Um, I suppose we are going in. Alright, let's see if we can beat the final boss of this area. I am nervous, because this guy is very fast, very dangerous, and I have to be on the freaking ball with that silver pendant. I know we've gone over a time, but you know what? We're right at the end here, so we're just gonna rock and roll. So here's Manus, the very first human right here. The furtive pygmy is what most people think this guy is. And this is what you become when you have been corrupted by the Dark Soul. I'm trying to remember his, his attacks here. Okay, so this doesn't do that much damage to him. Let's see what this does. Okay, that does, oh, does a little bit more decent damage. Okay. Oh. Kind of getting close to me. Oh my gosh. Oh god. Oh my god. Oh jeez. Oh motherfucker. Ow. Jeez. Oh my gosh. Okay, so that's the move that uh, if you let him slam his fist like that, um, that's actually the best the best time to uh, attack him. If I could just fucking get away. Oh my goodness, maybe this weapon isn't very good. I honestly don't know what his weakness is, if anything. Oh. Ow. Bastard. Oh my goodness, I just can't see. Come on. Come on, man. Ah, shit. Fuck, fuck, fuck. I need humanity. I need humanity. Give me humanity. Come on. Oh, shit. Ow, 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 ow. Okay. Alright, we're still okay. 
I haven't done any fucking damage to him. Ow, oh, God, ow, ow, Jesus. Fucking A. Ow, shit. Alright, run. Run. Oh, God. Alright, use a Hannity. Yes. Maybe I should block more. Let's block more. Ah, oh, shit. Okay. Man, he is just owning my face. Utterly. Okay. Maybe more careful. We need way more careful. So fast. He's so freaking fast. My god. Oh my goodness. Whoa. Oh, come on, man. Okay, so another word of advice. Don't get caught in that fucking spell. Hit your hand. Hit your hand. Your formerly human hand. Oh, oh. I'm like trying to focus as hard as I possibly can. This is crazy. Let's use the humanity. Ouch. Bitch. Oh, what am I doing? God. I am just doing so poorly. Alright, come on. I can do this. I cannot do this. Ow. Damn it all. Oh, I just need to heal. One time. One time. There we go. Ooh. Oh, come on. Ah, oh, shit, 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 shit. No, 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 no. Ow. God, this guy is just so insanely fast. Ah, fuck. And I died instantly. So that's the move right there that you need the silver pendant for. All right, guys, we, we have actually gone way over our time. Uh, in the next episode, we will kill this dude, and we will also go kill Gwyn, and we can put an end to this game once and for all. All right, guys, I will talk to you in the next one. See ya.